Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome to my channel. So today we are going to be testing out the Big Ego Palette by Tarte. Um, this is a real pretty palette. I couldn't pass it up. I saw it and I was like, I have got to get this. So these are the colors here. We're gonna test those out today. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and start priming my lids and we'll start applying the eyeshadow. And I'm just here using the Catrice Eye Foundation um, Eye Primer. And then as always, I am just using my e.l.f. concealer brush and I'm just going to blend in the lids with the primer. Alright, so now that the lids are blended, um, I think I'm just going to take a couple transition shades over here. Um, so I think I'm going to take this one, which is called Authentic, and I'm going to take Brave. So I'm just going to take these two colors here, blend them into the eyelid. So those are just the transition colors. And then I think I'm gonna do like a purplish, kind of pinkish color here and see what I can create. I did see a real cute look on the eyeshadow palette itself and I'm gonna try and recreate it. Okay, so I'm going to take like this black color here and it's called Own It. I'm gonna take it and I'm just gonna put it above my eyelid. I'm just gonna put a little bit above there. And of course, I'm going to take a blending brush and blend those colors out. Okay, so I'm going to take these like colors here. It's called Power Move and Bold. I'm just going to mix these colors. These are real pretty. I'm just going to mix these colors here and I'm just going to place these on my eyelid. Okay, so it's not picking up that well, so I'm gonna go ahead and spray my brush and then do it again. There we go, it's building up now. And I'm just gonna apply it on half of my eyelid and then the other half I'm gonna apply the pink and see how it does. I think I'm gonna switch brushes and spray it. I think I need like a flat brush for that to really pick up, so. And then on the next side, I'm going to take the pink on the next side and spray my brush as well. So for the pink colors, oops, I almost dropped it. So on the pink colors, I'm going to mix, um, this one's called Visionary and then the other one is called Daring. So I'm just gonna dip and spray. Make sure I get on the right side here. Okay, so I'm finding if I do that tapping motion, if you watched my video previously to this, I find if I'm doing the tapping motion that it's sticking more. So I'm just gonna continue doing that tapping motion with that pink color, and then I may go back and do that with that blue color, that purplish blue color. Now let's try to get this eye to look like this eye. Okay. 
Yeah, definitely going a lot faster with this eye, just tapping it. Okay, so that is the color right there. I don't know if you guys can see it, but yeah, this is the color right here. It looks really pretty. I like it. It's really, really pretty. So I was going to add on some wing liner, but I don't think I'm going to. I think I'm just going to um, put on some lashes and do some mascara and everything, and then we'll worry about the rest later. All right, so we're going to go ahead and put on the foundation and everything like that and go ahead and prep the face. Um, so I am just going to go ahead and take my NYX uh, Bear With Me uh, setting spray here. I'm going to go ahead and prep the face here. Okay, and I'm going to go ahead and do my eyebrows. I don't know. I like this... Um, eyebrow pencil that I got in my BoxyCharm. So I'm really liking it and I really don't do anything with eyebrows, but I really like it. Um, I do notice someone said that my my lights, my lights are bright, um, studio lights, um, said that my eyebrow wasn't showing. So with the light reflection, it's probably this one or this one, but either one, I'm not showing. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do that real quick. That way I can bring a little bit of color due to the lighting in here. I'm just going to use my Catrice primer like usual, the Poreless Blur Primer. This is hands down one of my favorites, one of my holy grails. And while the primer is sitting on the face, I'm going to go ahead and put my lashes on. I'm going to use my Kiss Lashes, the number 11s. I'm going to put these on and I will be right back. All right, so lashes are on and we're going to go ahead and get into the foundation. So today I am going to use NARS and it's the Sheer Glow Foundation. And I have it in the shade Medium Dark 2, which is in Tahoe. So I'm just going to shake it up. And it's a twist, twist knob foundation. And I'm just gonna put it on a beauty blender. I have my e.l.f. sponge here. I like this one, and then I like the one from Wet n' Wild. They're really good on your face. So I'm just gonna apply this on here. Actually, no, I'm just gonna put this on my finger. Dab it in. Looks a little bit dark, but it'll work. So I'm just going to blend this in with my beauty sponge. And I like NARS. NARS is a really good brand. And this is a glowy foundation, so it's gonna leave my skin with a little bit of glow, which is okay. In the winter, I like more of a matte look, but I decided to switch it up with foundations today, so. Okay. And then I'm gonna put on some concealer, and I'm still, I'm gonna use my Dose of Colors. Um, we're gonna put that on today. All right. 
right, so we're gonna let that sit for a couple minutes, then I'll be right back to blend it out and apply the rest of the makeup. So we're gonna go ahead and blend out the concealer. I'm just gonna use my e.l.f. beauty sponge and I'm gonna blend that out. So I'm just gonna take the corner here and I'm just gonna blend that out under my eye. So the concealer has been blended in, so we're going to go ahead and um, set the under eyes. So I'm still loving, actually, I'm going to change it up. We're going to go ahead and set the under eyes, and I'm going to use the Maybelline Fit Me. I am currently in medium deep, so we're going to use that today. So I'm just taking my Real Techniques setting brush and just, you know, setting the under eyes here. And then I'm just going to take a little bit more dense brush and apply it on my face. Okay, so now we're going to do a bronzer, blush, and highlight, and then we'll come back at the end and finish the eyes. Yeah, Ofra Cosmetics bronzer powder here. As far as blush goes, I'm gonna use my LA Girl Island Hottie palette. So I'm gonna use this palette here. Try and tone down this bronzer some. So I'm going to take this pink color here, and this one is called Unique. So I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna dip, actually I'm gonna dip and spray my brush. Oh yeah, that's really pigmented. Oh Lord, what was I doing? I ain't no rules to make up, isn't that what I just said? No, I'm gonna mess up the look with this. No, I'm not, I'm gonna tone it down with that sponge, that's what I'm gonna do. But I'm still gonna rock it on the next side too. I'm just gonna dab it though. There we go. So that's a lot better on this side than the other one. But hey, no rules to makeup. Do what works for you. There we go. That looks a lot better. Let me just sprinkle some of this by my brow bone. There we go. Okay. She pretty. Okay. So we did that. Now. Let's go ahead and do the lower lash line. So this is what I've been waiting on. This is what I've been wanting to do. I just gotta find me a little bitty pencil brush. I got a couple of them here. So what I'm gonna do is take these two colors, that blue and that pink that I used, I'm gonna do it the same at the bottom. I don't know if I'm gonna spray my brush. We'll see how it picks up at the bottom lash line, see if I need to spray it or not. But let me go ahead and try it here. So let me go ahead and do these blues here and see what happens. I'm gonna go ahead and put on some um, eyeliner on the lower lash line, and then we'll put on mascara and we'll be all set, almost after we put some lips on too. And I'm just taking these two pink colors here and we're just gonna match it up.
So there's that. So like when you do it, you just create like a little V. All right, so we're gonna set the face with the Wet n Wild um, finishing powder. Um, we're gonna use this one again. This was in medium tan. I'm gonna set the face with that. And put on the lower lash mascara now. All right, so we're just gonna put on some lips. Again, I'm still loving the um, teddy bear in Milani. All right, guys, so this completes the look. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, there will be more content loading. If you have not subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. As always, stay blessed.